Cloud Computing, the History Before introducing the cloud computing and all its topics, let's take a look back at the history of cloud computing. The history of cloud computing unbelievably began in the 1960s. As you would imagine, the cloud has been through a lot of changes with new platforms and products coming to market. In, 19, in 1960s, the computer scientist John McCarthy came up with concept of time sharing and enabling organization to simultaneously use an expensive mainframe. This computing is described as a significant contribution to the de development of the internet and the pioneer of cloud computing. In 1969, GCR like LIDAR helped develop the ARPANET, Advanced Research Projects Agency Network, a very primitive version of the Internet. The meaning of virtualization began shifting in the 1970s and now describes the creation of a virtual machine that acts like a real computer with a fully functional operating system. The concept of virtualization has evolved with the Internet as business began offering virtual private networks as a rentable service. The use of virtual computers became popular in the 1990s, leading to the development of the modern cloud computing infrastructure. By the end of 1990, the first web page was served on the open internet, and in 1991, People outside of CERN, the European Council for Nuclear Research, were invited to join this new web community. The first known definition of the term cloud computing seems to be by Prof. Ramanad Shelapa in Dallas in 1997. He defined the cloud computing as a paradigm where the boundaries of computing will be determined by economic, rational rather than technical limits alone. The arrival of Salesforce.com in 1999 pioneered the concept of delivering enterprise applications via simple website. The services firm covered the way for both specialist and mainstream software firms to deliver applications over the internet. In 2006, Amazon launched Amazon Web Services, which offers online services to other websites or clients. In April 2008, Google announced App Engine, a platform for developing and hosting web applications in Google Managed Data Centers, which was the first cloud computing service from the company. The service became generally available in November 2011. Since the announcement of the App Engine, Google added multiple cloud services to the platform. By reaching 2014, the global cloud spending was estimated for $170 billion. And in October 15, 2014, Microsoft announced the integration of the Docker Engine into Windows Server, as well as native support for the Docker client role in Windows. And in November 2014, Docker Container Services were announced for the Amazon Elastic Compute Cloud, EC2. In 2015, Google introduces virtual machines for half the cost when it was first, first introduced. And by decreasing the price, the use of cloud computing services has deeply increased. And in 2016, Google Cloud Functions provided new services as computing, data storage, data analytics, and machine learning. In 2017 September, Google Cloud Platform launched the paper second billing for VM, and by October of the same year, Amazon followed Google and offered the same billing model, I mean the paper second billing model. By reaching 2019, the content delivery network market was estimated to be more than $12 billion. And in this year, 2020, and despite the COVID-19 crisis, the growth global market for cloud computing is estimated to exceed over 
370 billion dollars. This was a brief overview about the history of cloud computing.